How was your holiday? I was making money. And to think, you call me lazy. You've done a great job. Well, that crew did help. A little house, a barn. Look at this place. <laughs> I can't believe it. Thank you. Thank you both. This calls for a drink. Young Miss at Dancing School has taught the minuet to tread. Young Miss at Dancing School has taught the minuet to tread. But we go better when we brought our four-tack to Cathead. Come bustle, bustle, drink about, and let us merry be. Our can is full, we'll pump it out, and then all hands to see. When horn and hounds the forest rend, his pack the huntsman cheers. When horn and hounds the forest rend, his pack the huntsman cheers. As loud as halloo when we send a broadside to Mount Sears. As loud as halloo when we send a broadside to Mount Sears. Come bustle, bustle, drink about, and let us merry be. Our can is full, we'll pump it out, and then our hands to see. What's got at sea we spend on shore on sweethearts and our wives? What's got at sea we spend on shore at sweethearts and our wives? And then my boys hoist sail for more, thus passes sailors' lives. And then my boys hoist sail for more, thus passes sailors' lives. Come bustle, bustle, drink about, and let us merry be. Our can is full, let's fight it out, and then our hands to see. Yeah! <laughs> Them boys got wasted. Get out here! Uncle's gone. He's fine. Let me sleep. Get out here now! <sighs> that fat man will be fine. No, he won't. Skinner's. You think? Of course. My guess is they went that way. But my other guess is they know we're coming after them. What choice do we have? None. <whistles> we just gotta keep our wits about us. We know this is a trap. <clears throat> Let go. Yeah. We can't leave this waiting. I tracked them to the road. We'll pick up the trail there. Shit. It's like we forgot about them. We should have been ready. It happened. There's nothing we can do except try and get him back. We let our guards down for one moment. Hush. Up here. You see that? Blood. Dear Lord. They've gone up towards tall trees. Come on. John, look, we should agree on something. If it's really bad, this might not be about saving him. What the hell are you talking about? If it's really bad, it might be better to stop the pain. Jesus, you mean to... I mean, you can live a week without a scalp, but it ain't a good week. A gut wound, you can live a month, but it's horrible. What they've done to him might have killed him already, with only hurt to come. We get him, and we see, okay? We'll make it his call if we can. But it may be we have to decide. Okay? Okay. Did you hear something? Yeah. You think they saw us coming? I don't know. Guess we'll soon find out. We'll be better off going on on foot. Okay. Leave the horses in the trees there. All right, girl. Stay. To the trees. Come on. There, to the right. Two Skinners. 
Luck out? Probably. Take one. I'll take the other. They're down. Move. They were waiting for us. Uncle should be close. He better be. Keep your head. We'll find him. Come on. Hold. Patrol to our left. Easy, easy. Let him go. Hold it. If they come from the ranch, they'll come this way. We should have burned it while they slept. The burning's better if they're awake for it. He's old and sick. He won't last long. Then when they come, they'll come for a corpse. He was talking about Uncle. He's alive. Mm. Come on. They've passed. Let's go. It was an odd looking route. Hold up. You hear that? Yeah. Wagon. It's there. It's dragging someone. Is it uncle? No. Some other poor bastard. Let's follow. He might lead us to the camp. I think I see something. Uh-huh. Yeah, that must be their camp. What do we do? Let's get up on that boulder, take a look. <sighs> Hang in there, old man. through this mist. Can you look too? Hold on. Uh. Oh, I don't know. Where are you going? Come over here. Get a better angle. John. Need to be sure. Get over here. Don't go until we're sure. What do you see? Nothing yet. God, we gotta go get him. Careful. Where are they? Where are they? I don't care. Come on, uh, Charles. Uh, 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 oh. Behind you.
The surprise is over. We're here for you. Well, I thought being on the right, on the rock, might not be a bad idea. Maybe it is. Although, I was going to say crouched. Speaker in here. They're coming in from everywhere. Behind the rocks. There. We're here all dead. Hold on. Here. They came for the old dog. Uncle, hold on! Look, they came for him! Get out of bitter bastard, you! Leave one for me, John! Get the other! Take them down! Okay, old man. I look okay. You look awful. You'll be okay. Those bastards. We got him. Oh. Looks like we got here just in time. God. Maybe a little late tonight. Come on, Uncle. Come on. Ready? Whoa! Got him? Cause here come the rest of them. Quick! There's more of them. I'll cover you. Come on. Down that gully. You're all right. I don't feel all well. On top of us. Now, right. Stay behind me. Oh man. John, you okay? Get me out of here! What the? <laughs> Don is not as good a shooter as Arthur is. Got him? Cause here come the rest of them. Quick! There's more of them. Come on! Down that gully! Oh, oh damn! Up on the log! <laughs> to the right! Ah! Almost got me! Ah! Watch yourself! <laughs> We're not clear! You move! Move it. Move it. 
Woods. I'm getting. Does it look okay? You should go home. Break. Through. I don't feel good. Careful, jump behind you. We're out. We ain't out till we're home. Right hard! Oh man, how's the back? I think it looks worse than it is. Burns don't always heal easy. Sure, but I think this will be fine. As long as it don't get infected. It's much better than I feared. Hear that, old man? This could have been worse. He's pretty weak. Yeah, I bet. Stay with us, you old bastard. Ah, I can't, I can't hit my back. Over here. Almost back. Hang in there, old timer. I'm feeling real weird. Whoa! <laughs> oh, don't let me fall, please! <sighs> Uncle? Uncle? Hey. <sighs> We're here. All right. Let's get you down. Let me see. I got you. I got you. Come on. Come on. Let's get him out of Thank you, boys. Don't mention it. I thought I was dead. Uh, don't get all sentimental now, old man. They left his underwear on. I think you're dying. It's gonna be okay. A few days, you're gonna be just fine. You're a survivor. Easy, easy. I was say his ass would be burnt, but uh, looks like the back flat flat might have been open. It'll so be fine. You think they'll be back? Maybe, but I doubt it. We must have killed most of them. Now, this is your land. Was it theirs once? I don't think so. I met a fellow said the Skinners rode down about two years ago. They're just angry men on a rampage, and we got in their way. Sort of like we used to be? <sighs> yeah, exactly like we used to be. Maybe we should take up torture. <laughs> uh, we got Uncle singing instead of torture. We're going to be safe here, John. Hmm? Yeah. You? Your family, you all be safe. I hope so. I really do. If she ever comes back. always did have that fine way with words. You doing all right, son? Sure, Pop. Can I go see the house? Sure. 
Give him some time. He'll warm up. It's quite a place you got here. It's yours. Ours. I should see about that boy. Who's my new rival? Oh, that's Rufus. He's loyal, dumb, and angry, so he reminded us of you. That's your idea of a joke, miss? I guess. Come on! And I don't know how long this epilogue is. I was really hoping to get done with tonight. And I don't know if so I'm going to be open. I think so. <laughs> and I did good? You did good. So... <laughs> am I forgiven? <laughs> Never. <sighs> you are a hard woman. <laughs> Ma! Pa! Come out here! <laughs> You're alive! John, it's... Sadie Ann. <laughs> well, how'd you know she was... We... I'm... Sorry, I you thought I... You well. <laughs> I'm so happy. I'm so happy. <laughs> well, come on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but tell me about you, darling. No, arm to the teeth like that. I'm a working woman, Abigail. I'm a bounty hunter, bodyguard. I protect the gold prospectors up in the hills. I'm thinking of starting my own transportation business. I was thinking maybe if John wanted to earn some money. My husband, he ain't looking for that kind of work. I took on a lot of debt when we bought this place. And you're working for her to pay it off? Yes, sometimes I was. But I thought we said no more of that. No, you said that. What else am I going to do? I'm a goddamn man. It's legal work, Abigail. And I never got killed. It's hunting down fools for the government. Easy. Even Jack could do it. Don't you put those stupid ideas in the boy's head. He's going to do something better than this. Like what? Writing silly stories? I'm sorry, Abigail. Really, I am. I just thought if you wanted to earn some money... How many times do I got to bury you, John Marston? Never. You ain't never burying me. It's legal work that I can handle. There's a... There's something else. Micah? Bounty hunting is one thing, but goddamn Micah? I heard he was up country, or some fellow who sounded just like him. Killed a family, bar a little girl who escaped. Leave Micah alone. Listen, I'm sorry, Abigail. I came by because I was riding by chasing a fella, and I thought John wanted to earn some extra money. <sighs> what is it? Abigail, we need the money. Some fella robbed his business. You know, an accountant or something. Came down from Rhodes, I believe. How much does it pay? It pays good. You know, the soft ones usually do. Okay, then. I guess. But Micah? No. All right. John Marston, let's go. Just you bring him back to me. You hear? Of course. He has buried him a few work? times. Let's do it. You ready? Follow me. We're going up into tall trees. Hey. It's nice of you to stop by and see the place. Finally. Abigail's back with the boy. He must be so pleased, John. And the ranch? You were right. 
It's really something. I think I'm gonna ask her to uh, marry me. I got a ring. It was it was Arthur's. I found it in a bundle of things that I've kept. You're marrying Abigail, or it, asking her at least. Oh my! I never took you for a romantic. No, me neither. But <laughs> it's something I've thought about, and I I think I know I want it. Okay. I guess I thought you were married already, long ago. No, n not really. Not officially. Well, I'm real happy for you, Joan. Being married, it made me real happy. Well, it made you real sad. We're cutting off the main track up here. My man's in need of post. So, we're coming up on where he's been seen. This moron accountant, Marshall Thurwell, been trying to live like an outdoorsman. Camping out here. He's lucky the Skinner brothers ain't found him. Well, they might have. Up here. Must be it. Get down. Let's take a look around. Something's been here. This... This looks... Looks like a bear. Or something came through here. <sighs> and fella left in quite a hurry. Here. Oh, he was from the south. Whoever he is. Then maybe he's our man. If you ain't become some bear's lunch. Yeah, it looks like they went this way. Him or the bear? <clears throat> Both of them. Mount up. Let's find him. It's that way, I'd say. Great. Okay, I think I got him. Follow me. Yeah, this way. It keeps going through here. There's a cabin up here. Yep. <laughs> My God. Crap. Ugh, well, that ain't pretty. Oh boy, that our fella? Maybe, but looks more like a local farmer to me. Or what's left of one. Is it gone? You, Marshal Thurwell? That I am, ma'am. I'm here to arrest you on behalf of the state of Lemoyne. You're wanted for theft, fraud, and avoiding arrest. Is the monster still out there? No. I think he's gone. Come out! Come on. Don't shoot. <laughs> Keep walking. <laughs> Come on. I'm coming. Look out! Oh, <laughs> 
Good God. I think he's gone. Oh, fucking monster. Darwell! Get out here! Before I come in there and kill you myself! I, I, I'm coming. Pathetic. Waiting to see if that animal ate us? No, ma'am. That weren't it. Yes, it were. Come here! Come here. <laughs> Sir Will. Call yourself a man? Well, it's like Abigail says. That's one word for you. I can't believe we didn't kill that bastard. Gave him something to remember us by, at least. Maybe if we had something stronger than our revolver. find a way to almost get killed, don't we? <laughs> mm-hmm. That's kind of the problem. Maybe it wasn't right of me to bring you along on those really heavy things. A family man and all. Seeing all this? Uh, I don't know if I can do it again. I'm my own man, ain't I? I get to make those calls. I needed the money. You are your own man, sure. But... I'm my own woman, and I get to say who I ride with. And I don't know if your ranch, and your kid, and your wife are things I want to be worrying about when I hear a gunshot. Yeah, fair enough. Those are fine new clothes, by the way. <laughs> yeah, I spend my cash on... Who's this up here? Is that? Are you Sadie Adler, ma'am? The bounty hunter? Get off the road! Look, I got great respect for you professionally, but if that's Marshal Thorwell there, uh, me and my partner would like to split the reward. You're doing what? Get off the road! We was thinking you might need protect. Drop him! Can you pick it up, please? Don't mess around, do you? Let's go. Ha! Them bastards was green. If we didn't get him, someone else would have. This is a cold business, ain't it? <laughs> yep. It does require a certain level of detachment. You ever think if it's right? No. I just see orders on the wall, and I try and fill them. And if there's other bastards after the same orders as I am, I get competitive. It's called industry. And if you ain't noticed, everyone is out there doing it. I guess they are. Uh, you said earlier you knew something about Micah. You gonna tell me what you know? Are you sure you wanna hear about him? Ain't all that back at your ranch enough? If I find him, I will handle it. Your bounties or transport work, that's your decision to bring me along or not. But, but Micah, that's something we, well, I, I gotta do. With or without you, Sadie. You know what I mean? Okay, okay. I know. Well, I'm hearing things. A lot of things. Still, mostly just whispers, but I think you might be pretty close. When you hear something real, you bring it to me. Okay. Yeah. I'll bring it to you. But you think about if this is what you really want. Everything you can get, and everything you could lose. Here, put him down. Go on. Get home to your wife. I'll let you know if I hear anything about Micah. You need a hand taking him in? 
Him? No, I'm fine. You sure? Yeah, I'll send your share to the bank when I get paid. Thank you. 